everyone, I'm Devin Coombs, and today I will be going over question four of the managerial accounting a subject in our series. So it reads, manufacturing costs typically consist of either A, direct materials, direct labor, and manufacturing overhead, B, production and shipping costs, C, production and marketing costs, D, direct materials, direct labor, and administrative costs, or E, direct materials, direct labor, marketing, and administrative costs. So to understand this question, we have to know these definitions. So direct materials are any direct items that we use to make a product. So if I'm making a desk out of wood, the wood would be a direct material. Direct labor is anyone used directly in building a product. So that would be the person who builds that desk. And manufacturing overhead is everything else that goes into that product, like the electricity or very minor uh, items like maybe screws. So those are all different ways we track costs. Uh, so A is the correct answer here. An item typically consists of, in a manufacturing environment, direct materials, direct labor, and manufacturing overhead. So that is A. Uh, let's look over the other answers and see why they're not correct. Well, production and shipping costs are very vague, and they don't really consider maybe direct labor or uh, they don't consider manufacturing overhead. Also, shipping costs uh, we might not consider in the product because that wouldn't be appropriate for costing because shipping costs different to everywhere. It costs me more to ship something across the ocean than it does to my neighbor next door. So B would not be appropriate. C would not be appropriate because marketing costs generally wouldn't be associated with the cost of a manufacturing process. Uh, that We'll get into that later. Um, D, direct material, direct labor, and administrative costs. Again, administrative costs wouldn't be appropriate for costing a material in a manufacturing uh, process because it isn't really a direct cost. Uh, and also, the administrative cost could be associated with uh, other matters in the business, so it really wouldn't be appropriate. And lastly, uh, E, it includes marketing and administrative costs. Well, we went over why both of those are wrong, so uh, I think that's covered. So if you have any questions, feel free to comment below. I'll be happy to answer them, or feel free to write to me. Have a wonderful day.